Good afternoon, church family. Welcome to today's midweek minute on this beautiful Wednesday, March 29th. Had to check on the date. Hope you're doing good. Um, wanted to give a um, couple updates, a couple reminders of what is going on in the life of the church as we pretty much always do with the midweek minute. Nothing too unusual today. But I wanted to bring your attention to um, the upcoming Holy Week and Easter schedule, because that is coming up this Sunday. This Sunday is Palm Sunday, where we celebrate Jesus' triumphal entry into Jerusalem. And so we will be celebrating with palm branches, and our kids are, are really helping us lead worship, and it'll be a really full, good Sunday. We also have communion this Sunday. So I'm um, looking forward to this Sunday's Palm Sunday. So invite people, and hopefully we can you know, pack the place out. Um, this Sunday's Palm Sunday, April 7th, we are having a Good Friday service. Uh, we will be meeting downstairs in the fellowship hall and doing things a little bit different. Um, we're going to have a time of gathered worship, and we're also going to have different um, prayer stations set up. Um, we call them Stations of the Cross. I don't know if you've ever participated in something like that before, but um, it's kind of a more of a time of individual prayer and reflection. Um, so hopefully um, that is just a meaningful time of worship that night. That's uh, sun, uh, Friday, April 7th at 7 p.m. And again, we'll be down in the fellowship hall for that. And then the 9th, April 9th, is Easter Sunday. And with Easter Sunday, we will have um, a breakfast at 9, whole church family breakfast at 9, and then worship at 10. Um, so again, for that, we'll be celebrating the resurrection of Jesus Christ, the most important thing that's ever happened in the history of the world. So that is why we celebrate. That's why we sing. It's why we pray. It's why we do all the things that we do. So hopefully you're able to um, invite people to Easter, you know, welcome them to our church. And uh, hopefully it's a really, really good day of celebrating um, all that our Lord has done for us. Uh, for the Easter breakfast, uh, that is, if you're new to Trinity, that has been kind of a traditional thing uh, we've been doing for many, many years, even before I got here. But it's really fun, good breakfast, uh, but we need people to sign up to bring things. So in the narthex, I know there was a sign-up board. If you signed up for something already, thank you very, very much. If you didn't yet, uh, please take some time either this Sunday or uh, call the church office and let them know what you can bring. Um, but yeah, if you could help out by making something, bringing something, whatever you can do would uh, help make that day a lot nicer. So hopefully you can be um, can help out with that. Lastly, on top of our our whole you know Holy Week and, and Easter schedule stuff, I just wanted to give an update. Uh, we prayed over Brendan Smith this past Sunday, and he had surgery on Monday to remove some um, concerning cancerous spots. Um, uh, in and around his, his, his mouth and his jaw. Um, the surgery went really, really great. The doctor was, doctors were very optimistic about um, just what they saw. But um, So Brendan is home and recovering. I saw him today. He's doing really good. Uh, his pain is being managed, so he's, he's in a good amount of pain, but, um, but he's doing well. Uh, I wanted to just pass along two things. First, uh, be, please, please be in prayer. He's waiting on the results of a biopsy, which was part of the surgery. Uh, he should get those results on Monday, so please be praying for, uh, obviously, just really, really good results from that biopsy test. And I also wanted to pass along, Brendan wanted to say thank you to everybody. Um, he was really appreciative of so many people reaching out, so many people praying, just showing their concern and their love for him. He was just, um, just had so many words of thanks and appreciation that he wanted to give to his church family. So um, passing that along from Brendan, and uh, please continue to be praying for him. So thank you for that and for all the ways you care for uh, your brothers and sisters here at Trinity. But yeah, excited about, I mean, it's kind of cool. It's, it seems to be like it came up really quick. It feels like it was the dead of winter last week. Maybe it, maybe it was because March is weird, but it's cool that it's Palm Sunday and Easter is pretty much here. So um, yeah, be aware of that for our schedule. Um, all of these things will be in the midweek email. So if you are watching this on, um, on Facebook or on, on uh, YouTube and you don't get the midweek email and you'd like to, please contact the church office and give us your email address. We'll put you on the list. So that's it for now. I'll stop before I keep rambling and have a good week. Enjoy your day and hopefully we'll see you for Palm Sunday this week here at Trinity at 10 a.m. Have a good week.